Well, hello, everybody. Hello. So, guess what? It is almost Halloween. I know it is August, but to me, that means the start of spooky season, right? <laughs> it does. And the wind is blowing. The spooks are out. Well, better than that, Spirit Halloween is now open in select locations. That's right. We have our coffee from Starbucks, and we are ready to see some spooky merch. And show it all to you guys. We're in Cypress, California. We hear it's a really good spirit Halloween. We want to check out maybe some Barbie costumes, hopefully some haunted mansion merch, and who knows what else. Well, the spirits are calling, and Spirit Halloween is going to close pretty soon. So we had better get going. Follow us along. Why don't you to Spirit Halloween 2023? Okay, I look forward to this moment every year, going through the doors of Spirit Halloween. Ooh, this is a good location. I love this. Look at that. Very big. I feel like there's going to be a lot of scary, spooky animatronics. Okay, so we're definitely going to give you guys a tour of Spirit Halloween and hopefully check out some of the new merch. But we always check out the animatronics first because they have new ones every year. So why don't you follow us along and we'll show you a few scares, a few spooks, and ooh, maybe even a spooky scarecrow. I've been keeping these tools nice and sharp, just in case the farmer's spirit returns this year. I think he will be very pleased with how I've been running things, and I'm sure he'll be thrilled to see you. <laughs> Ooh, he's spooky. My goodness. Well. His head even twists. Oh, well, he's very tall. All right, time to enter the Spirit Hollow Cemetery. Ooh. What is this? Do you know what this is? Oh! Ah! Oh my gosh. First scare of the year. What else do we have in here? Wow. See, these big locations always have these awesome walkthroughs with spooky things. I almost feel like I'm in a scary maze. Here lies Hugs the Clown. We all sleep under the big top. Oh my goodness. Oh, okay, let's see what he does. <laughs> well. We have Dagger Mike is what he's called, it looks like, and he's $169. You're gonna have him in front of your house, maybe, perhaps. <laughs> wow, we also have Here Lies Nightcrawler. Why the long face? <laughs> this is so spooky. And I think this is another scarecrow, let's see. Ah! Wow, he has red eyes. Ah! Oh my goodness, who's he? This is Hellspawn for $329. I have a feeling this is gonna be very scary! Oh my gosh! Okay. Okay, we're leaving. So that almost scared me enough to drop our Starbucks. No! <laughs> yes. Wow second scare of the year exactly I guess. wow very spooky oh my goodness we have the widow here oh. she looks very scary and ah oh my gosh we have a killer clown <gasps> holding evil popcorn i think Ooh. this is the stuff that nightmares are made of ah he's so scary he's very tall too Wow, they always have all these really scary clowns at Spirit Halloween. Well, a lot of people are afraid of clowns, so they know what they're doing. Uh, Want to do the honors, Mom? I would be happy to. Ah, oh, that was unexpected. That, that's different. Wow. What about that Barbie merch we were talking about? Yep. Okay, so my mom and I wanted to check out the Barbie costumes first, of course. 
because if you know us, we definitely wanted to check them out. This is stuff we would wear normally, actually. Like yes. this cardigan. Why don't you show us what this is all about? It's oh. Barbie. So I actually purchased this at another Spirit Halloween recently, or like a few days ago, and I just thought it was really cute, and it might match a Barbie costume I'm going to wear this year. Plus, it comes with these really cute glasses. And it's only $39.99. The quality isn't too bad either, would you say, Mom? Actually, I think it's quite good. No, not bad. And look at these little buttons. They, they sparkle. It does say uh, not to dry clean or put in the washer, though. I okay. think it says to hand wash, but it's really cute. We can cute. do that. I can sacrifice. So we have this Western Ken costume. I feel like this is going to be really popular, and this is $39.99. It looks like all of these are selling out, by the way. So if you see something you want, I would probably just purchase it immediately. Last small here. Yeah, that's the last small. So, uh, Mom, I guess you lucked out today. I know, and hi, Ken. Oh, hi, Barbie. Hi, Ken. Hi, Barbie. <laughs> now, they don't have a Western Barbie just yet. Either they sold out, or I think they're coming in with more Barbie costumes pretty soon. So they don't have it just yet, but I look forward to seeing that. I feel like that's gonna be popular. We do have skating Ken here. Wow, that's really cute. I feel like that's gonna be really popular. It looks like they're sold out of the skating Barbie, but I saw skating Barbie at another Spirit Halloween store, so I'm just gonna show you guys a quick clip of that, just so you guys get an idea of what it looks like. They're both really cute. I feel like I'm gonna see a lot of matching skating Ken and Barbies this year. <laughs> I think so. I love everything Barbie. Yeah, this is all really cute. Another thing that looks like it's missing is the fanny pack. So I'll show another clip of that. It's like a neon fanny pack oh. and it was, oh, $16.99, not too bad. Oh. But that's really cute. It looks like it's sold out. Again, oh. these are just selling out a lot. But they're even coming out with more different styles of Barbie costumes, which is awesome for this year. I have a feeling this is going to be a popular item. Um, it looks like there's some accessories here. So we have this bandana. This looks like a little bandana that my mom and I would use, so I might actually get this for $7.99. And I think this would go with the Western Barbie costume. You would just wrap it around your neck. Yes. Nice little accessory. <gasps> See, I love this. There's also uh, Barbie press-on nails here. Way to go, Spirit Halloween, for $7.99. <gasps> just take my money, Spirit Halloween. Just take it all. <laughs> um, we have this nice little Barbie necklace. Ooh, that's really cute. Oh my gosh, $12.99. I feel like this would go well with any of these costumes, really, perfectly. Ooh, I like this. So we also have this jewelry set. <gasps> okay, for reals, okay, this is $12.99. And look at these earrings. This is the way to go. I actually didn't see this at the other Spirit Halloween, so maybe they had sold out. I think you should buy it. <laughs> it's really cute. I just might add that to the, the pile of my my merch haul today. <laughs> okay, we also have Weird Barbie here. Another popular one, I think, for this year. She's really cute. Nice costume. Um, I think, it, I think. oh, this one's $49.99, so a little bit more than the Western Ken costume. We also have this pink power jumpsuit. Mom, I feel like you probably have your eyes on this. <laughs> Not even for Halloween, but just to wear on an everyday basis. That would be me. That is just how we roll here in Lindsay Land. <laughs> <laughs> and this is $49.99. Now this costume I actually purchased already at the other store, just because it looked really, really cute and I think it would go with the cardigan pretty well. This actually includes the necklace shown in the picture. So that's really cute. I actually like this one maybe a little bit better, so maybe I'll add this to the haul, right? I know, along with the earrings. Along with everything else. Not only that, to go with all of these lovely costumes, we have a Barbie makeup kit. Not sure if I'm gonna be buying this today, because I feel like I'm already doing a lot of damage, but uh, those lashes are awesome. <laughs> and that lipstick color looks pretty on point too, and the eyeshadow kit. So if you need some Barbie colors and you don't have them already, I definitely would consider buying this for only $16.99, which isn't too bad. So I actually posted a TikTok showing all of the Barbie costumes this year, and a lot of people were asking about a Midge costume. <laughs> I think that would be cute, or an Allen costume. And what about the Knuff sweatshirt? 
be nice to see that. Well, if they don't have it at Spirit Halloween, I'm sure you can find those costumes somewhere, right? <laughs> I've seen them. Yes, but the Ken Nuff sweatshirt, I feel like that would be a golden opportunity for Spirit Halloween for sure. <laughs> Me too. But definitely everybody keep your eyes open. There's going to be more Barbie costumes coming out soon. Um, we'll be happy to see them, but our bank accounts probably won't. <laughs> oh, I actually didn't realize this, but for the Pink Power jumpsuit, it comes with these sunglasses and this little headband right here. Really cute. Most of these costumes come with accessories. Okay, so we're in the kids section and here's more Barbie costumes for kids. Oh, this is a cute little cosmetic kit, just for like a little girl and there's nails and everything. I kind of want this actually. <laughs> that's cute. Uh, this is the kids Western Barbie costume. So that's cute. Oh my gosh, I can't wait to see the adult one. I feel like that's gonna be really popular this year. And there's also a kid's pink power jumpsuit, just so everybody knows. Well, there's definitely a lot to film at Spirit Halloween, as you can see. We'll try to get to as much as we can, but for now, look at these fleece blankets. I have one of these and I use it all the time and they have pretty much any horror movie you can think of, they have a blanket of, right? Or Tippy uses it. Oh yeah, I had a blanket and now it's my cat's <laughs> blanket, actually. They have a Chucky one, they have an It one, they have a Corpse Bride, they have a ghost-based one even. They have Hocus Pocus one, they even have these little pillows and little things you can put on your bed. Oh, they have a Trick or Treat fleece throw, that's really cute. Even one that might give you nightmares. Oh look, here's a nice way to welcome our neighbors. What do you think, Mom? I don't know that they'd feel welcome in our neighborhood, maybe. What, not even with welcome, have a knife day? Probably not. But for now, oh look at all these little dolls here. There's a Beetlejuice. Oh, oh look, Delia. There's Lydia, actually, it's Lydia. Lydia. Ooh, we even have spooky Barbara and Adam from Beetlejuice. Really cute, and Beetlejuice himself, of course. Oh wow, I think this may be the scariest one yet. Want to do the honors, Mom? I'm afraid. Don't blame you. <laughs> oh. Ah. oh my gosh. Okay, it looks like we have the jumping spider again this year, and this was, this is $49.99, was $99.99. Jumping spider, all colors. How many Ooh. colors can you have for a spider? I don't know, oh my gosh. Okay, so you've got your brown, your Ew. black, and your multicolored. Oh, that's more information I ever wanted to know about spiders. Okay, so it's Miss Argentina, there she is. So she's cute, how much is that, Mom? Oh, let's take a look. It is $26.99. Oh. Now we have the Barbara and Adam doll, the spooky do. ones. <laughs> They're so cute. So do you think we should add Miss Argentina to the, I don't, the or mix? Or he's scary. I don't think I want him. Oh, that's perfect. How much is that one? Okay, this is $26.99. Oh, we might need that actually. But look at it. Oh my I gosh. Oh, that's why I love it so much. What else? Oh, Beetlejuice, Beetlejuice. Beetlejuice. Oh, oh <laughs> now he's gonna show up somewhere, but. No. Uh, there's a lot of Beetlejuice merch. There usually is. Uh, look at this. Let me see if I can turn it on. Oh, Woo. hey, that's really neat. What else? We have Adam and Barbara kind of mirror right here. See, so it has a picture of them on it. And, oh, this is my art and it is dangerous. Even some towels for the kitchen. We could just have a Beetlejuice house, Mom. The thing about Spirit Halloween, they always have these neato little signs here that you can hang up all around your house, such as this wonderful information about Beetlejuice and how to call him. And we also have a cute little Lydia here. She's popular this year, it looks like. And another Miss Argentina. Oh, I actually like this one. This is very Beetlejuice vibes here. I like here. it. I, I feel like this is $29.99. This would be really cute. I do too. Like just to have in the bathroom or something like that. For a little scare. Yeah, or all year round, <laughs> I think. <laughs> and what else? It looks like they had some Haunted Mansion merch here that may be sold out. But this is Madame Leota here. And that's cute. And I think it just kind of spins. <laughs> and it says from regions beyond. Oh, it's an eyeball. Nice. Uh. 
Who is she? Hmm. It doesn't look like she's working right now, but gee, look at that face. <laughs> ah! Oh my gosh! Ah! Oh my goodness. Well, thank you for those nightmares. Oh, it's a spooky pumpkin. Ah! Oh my goodness. That's really cool. You can see like the pumpkin seeds and everything. That's pretty terrifying. That reminds me of the pumpkin eater maze at Not Scary Farm. <laughs> wow, they have a lot of animatronics this year. Who's he? What's your name, sir? Yet more nightmares to add to the mix, I guess. Along with Miss. Ooh. Ah. Oh, goodness. This is called The Grave Watcher for $79.99. It's definitely a very grave. Ah. Little skeleton bones. Oh, hi, little friend. Ah! Okay. Huh. Well. Well. But the dead will play on you. Oh. Oh, do we not? Ah! Oh my gosh, I was not expecting that. I was not expecting that. Okay. Goodbye, Mr. Jumping Spider. Ooh, looks like we have a Frankenstein sidestepper over here. And also a Sam sidestepper. Pretty cute. What else do we have? Ah, it's Annabelle! Um, she's always terrifying. <laughs> and the sitting Sam doll as well. I actually really like Sam, so I'd be tempted to get that one. And even a good guy's doll. So he could be your friend till the end. What do you think, Mom? It could be our end. Oh, <laughs> it could be anybody's end. Wow, funny enough, it looks like stuff is already flying off the shelf. Oh my gosh. And it just opened up. But, so I bought this last year. This is a Michael Myers with a pumpkin. I really enjoy it, don't you? Enjoy seeing it in the living room, Mom? Just say yes. Yes. So I am kind of tempted to get this because I do love Sam. Trick or Treat is one of my favorite Halloween movies. I Maybe like this Trick light or up. Treat oh, too. Okay. okay, this lights up. That's cool. Hmm. Okay, this is $39.99. He's just so cute and spooky at the same time. That's why I like him. Oh, it's unmasked Sam over here. Does he light up? Oh, the pumpkin lights up. That's really cool. Okay, I don't know if I've se ever seen this before, but it looks like these are horror babies. And this is Baby Sam, who's even more terrifying than Adult Sam. And we even have Ghost Face Baby over here. He kind of looks cute, though. Look at that cute little face. Mom's like, nope. <laughs> Still not cute. <laughs> okay, they always have some really good Nightmare Before Christmas merch. And it looks like we have zero. You know what? I did want to buy this last year. Remember, I wanted to get zero. I do. I like zero. I did. I did. This is really cute. How much is he? Okay. Well, I hope it's it not too much. It is $19.99. Oh, throw it in the pile. That's not too bad at all. Oh, you. I love zero. He's cute. Look at his little nosy. Do you want this zero? No, I want this one. I want to hang him up somewhere. What else do we have here? Welcome to Halloween Town. Welcome indeed. And we have these, this cute little picture here. It's a lovely portrait. Oh, this is kind of nice. It's literally like a picture. You can hang it up somewhere for $24.99. It's really pretty. It actually looks like really good quality. So that's not a bad price. I agree. Oh, I didn't see this one last year. All hail the Pumpkin King. I've seen this though. Christmas comes to Halloween Town. Very important news indeed. We also have a couple of other things and Sally and Jack and Oh, we have even Oogie Boogie over here. <laughs> he'd be a cute little decoration on a, a couch or something, don't you think, Mom? He'd, he'd keep me up at night. Oh, maybe. Oh, I didn't see this before, but it looks like a 
Haunted Mansion snow globe, and it looks like this. Kind of recreates that scene in the Haunted Mansion at the end. Really cute. And it's a snow globe. Push the button. Oh, sure. Okay, so it lights up too. Nice. So as you can see over here, there's a whole section with just makeup and just wigs, like anything you could ever hope or dream for. Look at this, they even sell prosthetics here that you can use. And vampire teeth, wigs in just every color, anything you might need for your costume, and even hairspray so you can just spray your hair a different color. <laughs> There's bottles of blood. There's bottles of blood too, see they have everything here. Fun times, they even have this mini little witch hat. Oh, I think I have this actually. <laughs> I never wore it though, so that's gonna have to change this year. And we have things like bow ties and leggings and other things you may need for your costume, even masks over here. You know, if you're a cosplayer or if you go to events like, say, the Renaissance Fair or something mm -hmm. like that, if you're looking for just like an easy costume for those events, this would be a good place to start planning for those things, you know? I agree. Even a rubber oh, chicken. Or if you just need a rubber chicken for something, maybe or maybe a flower lay, something like that, then um, they have you covered. A jeweled crown, maybe some fake money. Do you think they have real money? Probably not. No. And lots of leggings over here. I think they even have stuff like cat ears and little bunny ears and things like that if you just want an easy costume. But if you want something more, then look at all of these. They definitely have you covered. Now we're not gonna get to filming all of this, but first of all, look at this 80s stuff. Like I kinda just wanna buy it to wear normally, you know? Like look at these hair ties. These are totally rad. This looks very Barbie too for oh, yeah. their rollerblading. Yeah, this looks very Barbie too. We have 80s sweatband set and look at this. Even leg warmers and fanny packs. <laughs> And if you want to look for eras, they have stuff like a 50s section and even a 70s section if you want to be a hippie maybe or, you know, wear a poodle skirt, something like that. <laughs> like I'm wearing. Like my mom's <laughs> wardrobe every day, you know. Oh, I saw this at the other Spirit Halloween and it's worth noting that they actually have pretty legit Ghostbusters costumes here. They have the jumpsuit over here and they have an actual proton pack right here, which looks very legit, and you can even get this walkie-talkie to go with it, and this PKE meter. Wow, and I'm guessing all this is pretty cheap. Not bad, it kind of makes me want to be a Ghostbuster this year. <laughs> <laughs> oh, and they have an inflatable Stay Puff. Okay, another thing which might be a hit this year is the Wednesday Adams costumes, because of the hit show Wednesday. I bet these are gonna be flying off the shelf. Uh, that looks like a cute dress. We have the traditional Wednesday Adams outfit, as you can see here, with this little doll to go with it that doesn't have a head. <laughs> really cute. They even have a, a makeup kit that you can try out. At the other Spirit Halloween location, they even had Wednesday's wig and a couple more things. But we have a Morticia Adams dress right here, and they have a wig for her. Really cute, of course, but I think the hit this year will be the Wednesday Adams dress. You might recognize this from the iconic dance she does in the Hit Wednesday show on Netflix. And this is a dress and it comes with a belt as well. It's just so pretty. Why don't you hold it, Mom? I agree. It's kind of hard to see with the reflection of the plastic, but this is really cute. And you can buy cute boots to go with it and put your hair up. I feel like we're going to see a lot of Wednesdays. And if you're not going to see Wednesday, you. you're going to see Ken and Barbie for I Halloween. Know. <laughs> okay, just for fun, because I love Sam. Look at these cute Sam costumes. And they had these, oh, they even have these earrings kind of themed from the movie. This cute little beanie right here. And even socks, and I think they have a few more things over here. Okay, more Sam costumes. Oh, I have this actually. It's a cute uh, costume piece, but it also makes a nice little decoration for the house. They even have a nice little trick-or-treat flannel here. And it says, always check your candy on it. And, oh, another thing that I have. It's a nice little costume piece like the other, but it might be kind of cute if you just put it in the kitchen somewhere as a, a prop or a decoration, I think. Scott might eat it. 
Oh, uh, he'd be very disappointed if you tried. Another thing to note is that at Spirit Halloween, they have cute little just purses like this that you can use for spooky season. And this is kind of new. I don't think I've seen these backpacks before. Have you, Mom? I have not. They have nice little fashion skirts here, like this little pumpkin skirt, which is really cute. And oh, why don't you show us that right there, Mom? Cute. Okay, I'm kind of liking the vibes here and it kind of ties in the front. You could wear it with jeans or shorts or something like that. See, it has vintage tie in the front and it comes with a candy bag and not bad quality either. Okay, here's another one of these little cute backpacks. They kind of look like lounge fly purses, but the material's a little different. And they're $29.99, so you can put all your candy in here maybe. I think that's really cute. I like that a lot. I actually really do too. <laughs> kind of tempted with this one. Yep. Along with Sam from Trick or Treat, they always have some really good Freddy Krueger stuff. <laughs> really cute beanies and costume pieces and even shirts. Same with the Killer Clowns. And they have some pretty good masks this year. They have Spiky over here and, and Shorty and really good costumes. We have Jumbo. <laughs> Shorty's the scariest, I think. He's small, but I don't know. He has a lot of scares in the movie. I'm just impressed you know their names. I know, funny. Well, they had this maze a couple years at HHN, mm -hmm. so that could be one of the reasons why. <laughs> oh my gosh, I don't think I saw these last year. So we even have little costume props. And look at that. This is the acid pie. <laughs> so you can use this with your costume. They even have a cotton candy gun. And all these, uh, they tend to sell out, as you can see. I remember that from last year. A lot of the Killer Clowns merch sold out really, really quickly. But yeah, um, be a Killer Clown this year and perhaps pick up a cotton candy gun. Let's see. Does it work? Oh! Ooh. 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 Well, we have all the titans of horror here. We also have some Chucky stuff, like this cute little purse. It's a night purse, oh my gosh. And we have a tip necklace, Chucky costumes, even a Tiffany costume as well, and nice little good guy sweater. For the people who are really hardcore with their Halloween decorations, we have some ghosties over here and hunted trees and a cat. You could put this in your yard maybe or wherever you want, even a lantern. And more yard stuff over here, which is really spooky. Also, we've reached the kids section. As you can see, there's a large selection for kids over here. Oh, it looks like there's also a Kids Wednesday Adams. Oh, this is the uniform, I think from the show, and that's really cute. And a regular uh, Wednesday Adams, the traditional costume right here. Oh, there's even a, the Wednesday Adams dress for kids. So there's a little one. They have just about everything here. We could actually spend hours at this store and do a lot of shopping damage and spend all our money, but I think we should probably check out, don't you think, Mom? I think we need to check out. <laughs> well, everybody, we've had our spooky Halloween fix for the day. We've had our iced coffees, we've done our shopping. It's so great to have Spirit Halloween back. We will definitely be back to buy more merch. But for now, unfortunately, the shop is about to close, plus we've spent all our money. So I think that means it is the end of our video, but only for now. Because we have tons of videos coming out really soon, now that Halloween season is right around the corner. Like literally, there it is. <laughs> so on that note, if you liked our video, please hit that like and subscribe button because it helps our channel out a whole lot. Plus, it'll keep you guys updated on our spooky adventures. So mom, like everybody else this year, do you think we're gonna be Barbie for Halloween? One of us is, or could I be Wednesday? Oh, maybe both. I mean, October is a long month, right? It There's is. There's plenty of Halloween costumes we can wear. And plenty of different variations with the Barbie costumes. We could be roller skating Barbie or Western Barbie. Maybe we could just be a Barbie for every day of the month of October. <laughs> <laughs> but then again, I feel like that's what we do anyway. Yeah. All year round, but. <laughs> Anyway, spooky friends, stay safe out there, stay awesome, and perhaps sometime we will see you at Spirit Halloween. Have a great day, everybody, and thank you so much for watching. Bye! Bye.